With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Two masses M1 and M2 connected by an inelastic string over a frictionless pulley are moving as shown in the figure. The coefficient of friction between the horizontal surface and the block is 0.15 then the minimum weight m that should be put on m2 to stop its motion so let's say the m2 is put on it right and we want the minimum value of it so that it does not move right so we want the acceleration of all the system to be zero right so if you see the tension force that should act for zero acceleration here it is if you see here the m1 g will act in downward direction and uh, t will act in upward direction as already shown in the figure m1 g is 50 newton so tension in the string for acceleration to be zero of m1 block is this right now we don't want these two to move right here the tension force we already calculated it is this so if you see here the net horizontal force should be zero and the tension force is equals to 50 newton since it is not moving we already assumed it right so if if i write down the horizontal force here friction force so from here if the acceleration of the system is zero then the tension force is equals to friction force is equals to should be equals to 50 newton so this we got the condition for the system not to accelerate now let us come to the value so if you see the vertical forces on this if on m1 m2 right it is weight and normal reaction right so it is m2 if you see m2 is 10 so I will write down 10 plus m into g in downward direction and normal reaction in up, upward direction. So normal reaction I will write down it is this alright. Now I will write down the friction force if you see here it is mu is it is 0.15. So I will write down the limiting friction is mu times of n and mu is this so I will write down it is 15 by 100 into into 10 so this 10 will get cancelled out and this will be 2 by 3 right so from here you can write down the limiting friction is 3 by 2 m plus m right so this we got limiting friction now if you see we want this block not to move so the tension force applied should be less than or equals to the limiting friction this should be the condition so tension force here is 50 and it should be less than equals to the limiting friction which is this so if you see this is 100 by 3 should be equals to this now if you see here m should be greater than if you take this 10 on that side it will be 70 by 3 right so the m should be more than equals to 70 by 3 right so if you calculate the value of 70 by 3 it is equals to 23.3 so finally i will write down m should be greater than equals to 23.3 kg in the question minimum weight m is asked right so minimum value will be 23.3 kg and if you see make this 3 and d is the correct one thank you for class 6 to 12 itg and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today